Over the years at our family gathering, you two show up and you ruin it. I want you to bring a date to your sister's wedding. We don't want you showing up stag and riling each other up. We don't rile each other up! We never get riled up! What makes a good wedding day? Uh, someone that likes to party and is willing to talk to your drunk uncle. Yeah, you know, you got to you got to be willing to take the hit a little bit. Talk to Uncle Larry. Find the right girls for this. Where do we even go? What? We're about to do something awesome. Oh my god, what makes a great wedding date? Look. You got to be if you got to be willing to hit that open bar and if the bar's not open, you just got to swallow it and just pay for the drinks and act like it is an open bar, okay? That's number 1 for a great date. Number 2, you got to shake it on that dance floor. And every now and then the DJ's dipping, right? And he's like not playing stuff that that gets you on the dance floor and you got to go out there anyway. You got to make it your own. That's what makes a great date. What makes a good wedding date? Somebody that's willing to put out um, somebody that <laughs> I'm just kidding kind of. Um, I think somebody that knows how to blend into any crowd because at a wedding you really want to just have fun with every single person there you know if you're a wallflower I don't think is for you um, yeah somebody that just wants to mingle and have fun with everyone you know somebody that loves grandpa down to nephew treat it um you know someone that has you know a good sense of humor and likes to drink alcohol and likes to dance. A dancer. Look at that teacher. Grabbing her apple a day. Look at that personality from behind. It is, dare I say, well-rounded. Mm-hmm.